All right, as you can see, um, this microscope has been um, in quite a bit of use and so it's quite dusty. Um, we usually clean it every six months because it does get used a lot. And so the first thing we'll do is we'll use this bulb thing, blow out the dust. This is just to get the dust off. We're going to take off the stage clips and there's this microscope has screws so we'll take the screws off all right and we're going to use the and we'll wipe the stage move it back and forth just to get the back area and we'll get the front Next, we're going to clean the body of the microscope. All right, we'll give the clip a nice wipe as well, both sides. All right, next thing we're going to do is use some lens paper. So next we're going to take these um, ocular lens covers off. So as you can see there was a cover on it for the eyes. Taking that off and we're going to make sure that we clean those as well. We'll wipe those as well with the cloth. Okay, so next thing we're going to use some lens paper to clean the lenses and the light. So we'll go and clean the light. Gonna clean the ocular lenses. Okay, next we're going to clean the objective lenses. We start with the lowest power and we go to the next. Okay, now we can take 
the stage clip and put it back on. Alright, so let's go ahead and begin. We'll go and plug this microscope. Alright, so it's pretty much ready, but what we need to do now is to check the lenses to make sure that everything works fine. So. Um, what I have here is a microscope slide and I use a um, marine diatoms because they're really easy to see and we put it under the scope and we check the each lens to make sure that it focuses and um, once we do that then we also check the light lighting as well and that's about it so now we're coming to this microscope grease stuff kind of yellowish in color and what we do is we have a um, basically like a you could use anything like a toothpick well thicker than a toothpick but we have a cotton swab right here so we use the other end of it and what we do is basically take a little bit and we put it right where the stage is moved so what you can do is you go back and forth a little bit move it around and you can put it on both sides as well so we'll take a little bit more and we come around and we put it right here this is for the other way and a little bit on this side and we move the stage going the other way so let's put some on this side as well around so it's nice and loose so it's moving really well you could even put some right as here as well again move it back and forth and you're good to go okay now we can wrap the cord around the microscope and put it away make sure that you cover it and if you're not going to be using it right away so the dust does not collect on it and you should be good for another six months so we usually date every time we clean our microscopes we usually date it and we put it right at the back so we know next time when to clean it. We cover this again to make sure that there are no dust that can go in while it's not in use.